My name is Richmond Wheeler and I live in Columbia, Missouri. I said I ride the transit. Um, I ride it to doctor's appointments. I ride it to go see friends and I ride it to the grocery store. I have a car right now. There have been times in my life though, certainly over the last 20 years here in Columbia, where either my vehicle was broken down or for whatever reason I didn't have transportation. So I have used the transit system to get back and forth to work before. I uh, ride the bus back and forth to work and grocery shopping and to the hospital at times. I use them to doctor's appointments and to get around to where I need to get to school. I use the bus to go to work and church and everywhere. I was really surprised actually by, by how um, the buses were clean. The stop that we got onto the bus at was well, ma well maintained. Um, the downtown bus station, the Wabash station, was very clean and I mean everything about the system was, everything is very professional. I like the cleanness of the buses now. I think the drivers are nice. I like it because they get me right at the front door of my job and to the different stores and different areas in the community. They're pretty much always on time. I like that the bus drivers, they'll let you know um, your stops before you get there. You better call down there and they'll let you know uh, where you need to get to and what bus you need to get to. They're very friendly. They tell you where you need to get off at. They show you where you need, if you have a plate, you can get off at. And they just, they're very reliable people and very friendly. The challenge I have with it is like, when I have to work on Sundays, and especially when, when it's cold weather, I have to walk. And that put a burden on me. I have had the job of case managing before, working with people who are trying to get back on their feet and get settled again when I worked at the domestic violence shelter here. And that could be very problematic for people who didn't have transportation. Um, if it eliminates the possibility of working evening jobs especially if you're going to be working Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday when the bus stops running at 6. And I've known plenty of women who got off their shift at uh, some place like Steak and Shake at 2 in the morning and they walked home. It's a bad situation for anybody. I mean, 45 minutes in between buses, if they're all running on schedule, um, if you miss the bus, obviously the minimum that you're going to be off in your schedule is going to be 45 minutes. They don't run long enough uh, during the day and they don't run all week. I can see a lot of scenarios that people would get into where it was far faster to just walk the distance. If I have to be somewhere and it only takes 15 minutes of my appointment, I would have to wait for a good 40 minutes before the next bus comes. It's the timing of things going to where they're going. So you're either at work 45 minutes early or you'd end up there 10 minutes late, which I know that can't be fine-tuned completely. But I think if we had more buses running more frequently, that wouldn't be a problem for people. It just seems like there's an awful lot of planning that would have to, have to take place for me to make using the bus. Anything other than a scheduled event, I mean, if it was something that I was going to take the exact same bus at the exact same time every single day to get to work and, get, and to get back, that's one thing that I can schedule ahead, but I, there's no way I can spontaneously decide that I'm going to take the bus. The buses need to run every day, seven days a week, um, because there's people that have to work and they don't have reliable transportation. And um, the times they need to run later because people get off work late and they don't have a way of getting home unless they walk or have to call somebody to come get them. The bus stops needs to be actually indicated, you know, because they used to have signs every stop. Now they don't. If they don't have enough shelters for people that, you know, when it's cold weather or bad weather out, and you have to stand on the stop, be on the corner, you have to stand there in the weather. Make improvements. I'd like to see more routes, uh, more you know, more buses on the routes and longer time frames. It should run, oh, I would like to see it go around the clock. You know, that way people really could get, if you were working at the hospital and you got off late or just anywhere, you could actually use the bus to get around. It's, it's not very feasible the way it is right now. Let the buses run all day, 24 hours a day. More buses, more frequently, smaller routes. The whole thing is fixing the window, it needs to be fixed. I work on Saturdays. We need hours, Saturday morning hours. 
for the bus service. I pay taxes. I think we all deserve it. 